good morning students today we are going to discuss part 2 of the invitation part second of the invitation okay as you all know very well as you all know very well that to invite someone we have to draft an invitation fine and invitation are of two types invitation are of two types first one is formal and second one is informal and we know very well that formal invitation are of two types again invitation has two are of two types has two categories formal and informal okay and formal invitation formal invitation are of two types how one is printed one one is printed one fine and second one is hand written or typed invitation hand written or typed invitation so printed one we are sending in bulk and hand written we are sending to someone who is very vip suppose in case you have to invite a uh, education minister to your school in the annual function so you will draft which kind of the invitation formal invitation hand written okay not printed printed one we have to write in bulk we are sending to everyone that is one by one that is printed invitation now we have already cleared it that characteristics of invitation formal invitations are features of formal invitation is what that it is written in the third person we are not using i am inviting suppose in case i have to write the invitation then how will i write mrs x y z okay request the pleasure of your company so it is written in the third person it is a single sentence presentation we are not using a uh, full stop comma any punctuation mark is not used and at last we will close it in a box the simple present tense is used then enclosed in a box do not exceed 50 words it is nowhere written that uh, we have we should not use more than 50 words but it is a standard criteria to write to write in 50 words if a word limit is given to us then we have to follow the actual word limit okay then the format of the invitation is formal invitation how we are writing name of the host suppose in case i have to write like this way so i'll write mrs or ms okay mrs or ms name of the host or host mrs and mr x y z mrs p q r okay whatever then a standard expression request the pleasure of your company or solicit your benign presence or cordially invite so we can use whatever we like then purpose of the invitation for what you are writing so mrs and mr then standard expression we have to use over here purpose of the invitation birthday ring ceremony okay then we can write down annual function house warming ceremony whatever then time name of the honorary suppose in case you are drafting an invitation okay for you are drafting a formal invitation for your sister's ring ceremony then you have to write down mrs or miss mrs or and mr x y z request the pleasure of your company on the grand occasion of ring ceremony ring ceremony of their daughter of their daughter we have to write down the honorary birthday person whatever then we have to write down timeline timeline on date we have to mention date day and time whatever the time okay the name of the place location where you are hosting that party where uh, wherever you are hosting that party function all we have to mention that address and at last we will use rsvp this way here we will use rsvp rsvp is a french expression response res uh, respond j sel wo play it means response respond if you please okay so if you would like to send the reply then you will send it on the uh, it on the address whatever is mentioned in the rsvp so this is the way of writing formal invitation printed one printed one name of the host who is who is drafting invitation then standard expression request the pleasure then function then name of the honorary then time date line then at last name of the place and rsvp okay and we will close it in a box 
okay now we will do some questions related to the formal invitation then we will carry on with more exercises hello so now we will see some examples of invitation and which kind of the invitation nowadays are we discussing formal invitation as we all know very well that that formal invitations are of two kinds first one is printed and the second one is second one is as we have discussed typed or handwritten fine and formal printed one printed one is to be sent in bulk and and the second one is sent to be vip person okay so now see a question over here suppose you are a student of sacred heart convent school macleod guns macleod guns and the school is holding its annual function at 5 pm on 5th september 2020 the education minister of the state has consented to be the chief guest design an invitation card to be sent to the parents and other invitees do not exceed 50 words so first of all we have to note down the point which point name of the host because we have to write i have on, on that day it is already clear to you that we have to we have to mention first of all what name or uh, name of the host who is the name uh, what is the name sacred heart convent school macleod ganj okay if you are writing if you are writing what if you are writing the principal and the staff member it is also okay then we can see which function beta annual function for what are you writing annual function okay and time is mentioned over here date is mentioned over here whatever we need okay so we have to write in that way we have we have what annual function at 5 pm on 5th september and the education minister of the state has consented to be the chief guest okay and the name of the host is principal or secret convent school macleod ganj okay now we will see now we will see the answer okay now we will see the answer the principal staff and the students you can directly write secret heart convent school but here principal staff and the students who is the host principal staff and, and the students name of the institution sacred heart convent school macleod ganj now second line is which line request line okay request line or the standard expression you can use solicit your benign presence you can use cordially invite you or sacred heart call request the pleasure of your company on the occasion of which occasion annual function so see if you have the ring ceremony then you are writing in which way mrs and mr mrs and mr suppose in case you have the ring ceremony at your home at your home so how are you uh, writing mrs and mrs and mr okay and the second line will be the same request the pleasure of your company on the grand occasion of fine same thing is mentioned over here principal staff and students of sacred heart convent school macleod ganj request the pleasure of your company request the pleasure of your company on the occasion of which occasion annual function okay name of the honorary of the school okay date time venue at 5 pm on 5th september 2020 in the school auditorium in the school auditorium okay now everything is mentioned over here then she jd dhiman education minister himachal pradesh has kindly consented to be the chief guest and give away the prizes and at last we have to mention rsvp what is rsvp responsible voice please it means re respond if you please so we are writing over here we are, we are not mentioning principal's home address we have to mention the school address because this function is related with the school rsvp principal sacred heart convent school macleod ganj okay and at last in note if you would like to write you can write down please do not carry mobile phones to the auditorium so beta have you got my point that only the third person only the only the name of the host it means in every invitation in formal invitation whenever you are writing formal invitation you have to write only change the name of the host okay name of the host will be changed and the request line will be same okay then name of the function will be changed 
time place will be changed but the matter will be in the same way matter will be in the same way okay so first of all we have to mention the name of the host then request line then name of the function timeline at last if you would like to mention some uh, what note and all you can mention over it fine so this is the way of writing formal invitation so we will take one more example over here suppose messrs sham lal and sons are opening a new journal store galaxy novel novelities in gitanjali enclave dwarka delhi the inauguration ceremony is fixed for sunday the 19th of october 2020 at 11 am prepare a draft of formal invitation letter for the purpose okay so same thing when we are sending in bulk we have to write in what way we have to write in formal printed way okay printed in card format so see over here who uh, who is the host over here who is the host over here beta who is the host over here messrs shamlal and sons okay means messrs shamlal and sons are host okay host then what function what function opening a new journal store means inauguration ceremony o name of the honorary galaxy novelities okay and date time is sunday the 19th of october 2020 and time is 11 am now same thing we have to mention over here messrs shamlal and sons second line standard expression to invite request the pleasure of your company on the grand occasion of or cordially invites you on what occasion on op on the opening ceremony or inauguration okay of galaxy novelty so it is the way of writing it is the way of writing card type invitation printed one so see answer master shamlan and sons announce the opening of galaxy novelties why why announce the opening why announce the opening is used over here you can also use request the pleasure of your company in place of announce the opening of you can write down request request the you can write down request the request the pleasure of your company request the pleasure of your company or or what you can write down you can write down uh, cordially invites you okay and now so it is also right but we just see over here announce we are not writing announces why because mrs uh, master shamlan and sons is plural okay so that's why we are writing announces if single name is mentioned over here only single name is uh, mentioned over here uh, mrs xyz or mr xyz then we have to write down announces then we have to write down announces okay then we have to write down announces fine so announces the opening of galaxy novelities galaxy novelities name of the only a journal store in gitanjali enclave address okay inauguration on date timeline all are cordially invited all are cordially invited means uh, it to uh, make our invitation attractive we are making one note or some expression visit for all kinds of grocery and domestic items okay fine and avail inaugural discount of 10% on all goods so what is it it is to attract to attract or to make our invitation to make our in invitation wonderful and special we have to mention these kind of some expression at last don't forget to mention rsvp rsvp respond sell boy voice plate means what respond if you please and see galaxy novelities what is it because the address of the address of that place address of that place because if we are not going there then we have to then we have to send our reply to galaxy novelities or we can send our reply or respond on the phone okay now we will see different kind of the uh, invitation related to different occasion formal printed one okay so your sister nivedita is going to marry akhilesh son of mr and mrs sm joshi nanital your father okay your father mr k s bhardwaj has planned to hold the wedding at hotel kunal new delhi on 25th 5th may 2020 at 8 pm write a formal invitation on behalf of mr and mrs k s bhardwaj inviting guests 
words to the auspicious occasion give other details do not exceed 50 words okay do not exceed 50 words now see over here who is the host who is the host over here who is the host your sister nivedita is going to marry akhilesh so honorary name is nivedita and akhilesh akhilesh father name is mr and mrs asm joshi nanital fine but in question it is given your father mr ks bharadwaj has planned to hold the wedding at hotel kunal new delhi on 25th may 2020 at 8 pm and we have and you have to write and you have to draft the invitation on behalf of mr and mr ks bharadwaj means your sister is going to is going to get married and you have to draft an invitation draft a formal invitation printed one on the behalf of mr and mrs ks bharadwaj fine and now how we, how uh, will we write it we will write like this way mr and mrs you can you can use over here what mr and mrs you can use over here beta mrs and mr fine you can like uh, you can write in this way also mr and mrs or mrs and mr mrs and mr fine then request the pleasure of your company on the auspicious occasion of so have you got my point name of the host name of the host and after name of the host we have to mention request line then after request line function name what is the name of the function occasion marriage of their daughter on a name nivedita with akhilesh in question we have already given akhilesh father father's name so we are writing son of mr and mrs sm joshi of nanital then we have to mention timeline on friday that 25th may 2020 so students can you see over here we can directly write down hotel kunal new delhi and we have to mention the program in marriage or in the uh, in the function in the function that has uh, that has event of two or three days we can mention the program list okay friday the 25th may 2020 the reception of barat dinner wedding ceremony and time saturday okay saturday 26 may 2020 doli okay rsvp is given over here what is given bhardwaj chemicals faridabad okay now see over here we are arranging we are arranging now i would like to mention over here that we are arranging the marriage function where the marriage function at hotel kunal but rsvp address is different because it is home address and we have to mention the home address while writing invitation i have on my uh, first video i have already cleared it that whenever we are writing and uh, whenever we are writing invitation we are inviting someone in hotel or somewhere but in rsvp we have to mention our home address because if someone is sending the reply he or she can send the reply at our house so bharadwaj chemicals faridabad new cosmetics new delhi phone number okay and with the best compliments from all relatives and friends or we can write down what bharadwaj family we can write down bharadwaj family or whatever we, uh, we we can write down some special requests some special names our uh, family members name we can mention over here so, fine so it is the uh, way of writing what formal invitation fine so first of all we have to mention what beta we have to mention name of the host then request line then function name in every function you have to mention over it suppose ring ceremony is there then mr and mrs ks bharadwaj request the pleasure of your company on the auspicious occasion of then ring ceremony of their daughter okay daughter name nivedita date time venue okay now i would like to make over here uh, i would like to mention over here what beta that suppose in case you don't want to follow the system of date time and uh, date time you don't want to write this way so you can write down date time and venue you can mention in this way also or you can close it in box okay in card we can write down separately in card we can make a box and we can write down date time venue okay it is not necessary to write in this way only which way date time venue fine 
so this is the way of writing formal invitation printed when i hope that you all will go through these questions and note down in your notebook fine so uh, go through these examples and tomorrow we will discuss for informal invitation okay informal invitation and and handwritten formal invitation fine thank you have a nice day